So uh, Mrs. India is always coming up with something new. And this year, uh, we have a special launch that's happening here today. I would like to invite Dipali ma'am to come and explain what it's all about, because it's very important. Thank you. How was it? Did we ever expect it that they will be like this? I mean, this question is especially for the husbands. They ever thought that the lady who is working in their home or, you know, is going around with them can be so glamorous. I think this one big round of applause for husbands as well. I think if husbands are not supportive, uh, you know, women generally keep supporting husband, but it's it's very rare that husband also support uh, his wife. And when that happens, the pageants like this happen. So it's all because of the husbands out there. So um, we, have, we are starting a print magazine called Tourism Queen. It's all about tourism and a queen, the queens who walked out here. So um, the, the goal of this magazine is basically to make uh, India a world capital of a tourism, you know, queen of tourism across the world, India should be. Because I think India have that heritage uh, that none of us have, the, the, as Aishwarya said before, before, after finishing her martial art, that we really don't have to go out of our boundaries. We ourselves itself is a world, you know, be it from uh, Kashmir to Kanyakumari, from Arunachal Pradesh to Gujarat. We are uh, so diverse and we are so beautiful that we have to showcase to the world. And with that um, enthusiasm, we are starting this magazine. Uh, it will cover fabric, fashion, food, frolic, and a fun of Indian tourism to attract global uh, tourists. <laughs> Thank you.